The people on those planets are hosed. Well, good luck getting Captain Quark to help you. Actually, you could help me. If you could use your ship to take me to the coordinates contained in this infobot, I might be able to gather further information there. Even if I wanted to, I can't. I'm missing a crucial component of the ship. The robotic ignition system. How did you know that? I, sir, happen to be equipped with the latest in robotic ignition systems. My programming allows me to start any ship I choose. So, I agree to take you to this wherever it is, and you get my ship started for me? That is what I'm proposing. Well, we're going to need to hurry. This could be a problem. Take care of it. Whoa, this is great! So that's where I've been stuck this whole time. Please return your appendages to the steering mechanism, sir. Huh? Oh, right. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, and by the way, you can stop calling me sir. The name's Ratchet. Pleased to make your acquaintance, sir. You got a name? My serial number is V54296. Oops. I'll just call you Clank for short. Hang on. I think I'm going to call him 354. Much better than Clank. So you see, it would be most beneficial if your citizens were not in the city when my workers begin removing it. Preposterous. I will not stand for this. Unfortunately, you have no choice in the matter. Let's just see what Captain Quark has to say about that, my good man. <laughs> I don't see what's so funny. Captain Quark could dispatch you without even breaking a sweat, you, you puny. You have now officially worn out your welcome and my patience. This is your last chance. Stop this madness now! Okay, wait. You're right. I will withdraw my troops. Really? No. He's all yours, gentlemen. Try not to leave any marks. Don't crash. Damn it. Sorry about that. Well, we're not leaving the way we came in. Perhaps we could procure a ship from one of the inhabitants. Yeah, sure. Why don't we hijack one? <laughs> okay, that's the autosave icon. Good to know. So we gotta st <laughs> we gotta go steal someone's ship. Got three more bomb gloves. Activate Gadgetron Vendor. What's this? I got some great bargains for you today. Bomb glove ammo. Twenty. Or they're only five bucks each. I think I got plenty. What is a pyrocyter? I don't have enough to buy it anyways, but I wonder what it does. I'm guessing it's some sort of flamethrower. Well, I guess we're going to be coming back here soon. Now, one thing I was mentioning in the last world... Don't drown now. One thing I was mentioning in the last world, I wonder if each of these worlds have a set amount of cogs you have to collect, or if they're unlimited. Because I know I'm playing right now Sly Cooper on Mondays, and there's technically an unlimited, unlimited supply of uh, money. But other platformers do have a limitation to them, so... Gonna have to figure that out as we go along. I'm guessing if I have to buy things, there might be unlimited money or unlimited screws. I don't trust that spinning blade. We're gonna just avoid that thing. Yeah. We're not even gonna just try to destroy it. Well, we might try and destroy it. Let's find out. No, you can't destroy those things. Okay. Just making sure. 
Now, what pretel are these? I saw these in the last world, too. Huh. Quite odd. I don't know. I'm sure it's one of those things we'll figure out later. Did we just smash that, or was that already smoking? I guess we can jump down there. Maybe. I'd rather not, though. Yep. Oh, we can swim, actually. Then how come the current before took us all the way down? I guess it might have been going too fast for us. So unlike our partner in Sly Cooper, we do have the ability to swim in this game. That's going to be very helpful. And I see no point of those things right there. Oh wait, more crates. Give us money. We want that pyro thing outside. I'm just gonna have to hope that this game has unlimited cogs and screws. Because I know I'm gonna be missing out on quite a few of them. I'll just try and buy all the items I can. Oh! Damn it. That was a pathetic slip. But yeah, like I said when I first started the LP, I'm going to be trying to do all six games on the PS2. From this one all the way up to Secret Agent Clank, which isn't really part of the main series, but still counts. Dad, blast it! <laughs> look, plumber's crack. What did you just say? I said, look, the plumber's back. All right, wise guy. Shouldn't you be on one of them escape transports? Escape transports? Newsflash, giant robots attacking! The escape transports are taking all the rich folks off this goddarn planet. So why aren't you on one? Socioeconomic disparity. What? He hasn't got enough bolts. Working people have to wait for Captain Quark to save us. Well, got anything worth a lot of bolts? I got this thing. Shows two weirdos ditching their ship. It's got coordinates to a desert planet, too. An info bot. Ratchet, we could use that. Hmm. Only 500. Though, if we buy this now... We're going to be even more far away from buying the pyro thing outside. And we'll wait to buy that. Let's see what else is in here. Yeah, I've already learned about that. Oh, is that another vendor? Oh no, that's the same guy. Well, I'm guessing we have no real other options, so... Yeah, let's buy the coordinates. The info bot. Unless we can go down there. And we'll go down there next. Hey, get back here. Mayday, Mayday! This is the Solar Ship Radical. We seem to be under attack from the planet's surface. Relax, kid. It looks like some sort of fireworks display. Probably in your honor. Whoa! That was close! Ah! Pipe down, I can't concentrate. Oh, we've been hit! Uh, an unexpected detour. When we land, I'll see if I can scare up an exhibition for you. We're not gonna live that long! Kid, let's am scream! Eject! Eject! Did you see that guy on the left? That was Skid McMarks. Does he know Captain Quark? I doubt it. He's a pro hoverboarder, always going off about how cool he is. Looks like he's in trouble. I'll say. 
I've never seen them look so freaked out. Gadgetron Infobots give you coordinates for new planets. Now that you have the Infobot for Planet Iridia, you'll need to find a ship to get there. Alright, we'll get there later. Right now I'm interested in that pyro thing outside. And we're already back out here. Too bad it's too expensive for us. Alright, let's go this way now. I don't remember this area being opened up. Maybe it was. Let's see, okay, we can dive too. Cool. Doesn't look like we can attack underwater though. 